Yo, what's up guys, Steven here, back in a YouTube video. And in this video, well, it's pretty self-explanatory. Look what's beside me, all around me. Look at the title. So yeah, I'm gonna be showing off some of the shoes in my shoe collection. This is just like the start of my shoe collection. Of course, I've gathered these shoes for a few years now, but it's just the start of the first video of my shoe collection. It's obviously gonna grow as time goes on. Um, so let's get started. Uh, what'd you say? This isn't proper attire for a shoe collection video. Shorts and no t-shirt and no socks. You're right, I'll change it. Three, two, one. All right, we're back. Um, I think this is proper attire for a shoe collection video. I don't know, you could be the judge. But yeah, uh, let's get into it. Actually, maybe I should change the hat. I don't think hats go with turtlenecks. No hat, whatever. So first shoe, it's a cleat, uh, which is this, the my Nike Air Zoom cleats. These are for indoor, I still have yet to wear them. I haven't really had time to go into uh, indoor soccer places, but if you wanna know, these shoes are called the Zoom Superfly 9 Academy FG slash MG. White slash Baltic Blue Pink Blast. Here's what this shoe looks like. As you can see, it's super clean. I love the white and the pink and the blue. It just really pops. There's the bottom of it. Yeah, this shoe only cost me like, a, or cleat only cost me like $100 or something. Not too bad. And I got like a free $30 gift card from Sport Check while with, with this purchase for no apparent reason. So that's also a dub. On to the next. Um, This shoe is an NMD. Uh, Adidas NMD. You can tell it's an NMD just by these two little tabs on the sides. And this, these are honestly one of my favorite shoes to wear. Reason being is because they're just so comfy. Like these ones right here, I'll get to in a little while. And these ones last me years. Oh, uh, but yeah, these were actually gifted um, to me from Jeremiah. These green, I actually have yet to wear them too because with a shoe, you need a good outfit. That being said, I do not have a good outfit with these green ones. Although I actually do have a green Nike hoodie and a other green hoodie I could probably wear with these, but these are kind of like a swampy green, not like the a forest alpine green that I have, but I'll wear these eventually. Also, they're like a size too big. Uh, he gave me this for my birthday before he left. RIP, Kelly, he didn't die. Uh, he just went back to Toronto. But yeah, I still have yet to wear these. Um, I'm hoping to see him in November, maybe. I'll get to that in a different video in the future. But yeah, thank you, Jeremiah, for these. Appreciate them. Have yet to wear them. Oh, dude, they smell like him. Oh. Uh, with these ones, uh, it can go. All right, with these black NMDs, I'll get to other shoes in a while. But these black NMDs, they're actually for one of my jobs at work because they require uh, black shoes, black pants, and the top, of course. Um, but yeah, these are literally my working shoes, and they actually still look in good condition. Like, I've had these for, I think, about three years now, which are really cool. Also, another cool thing about these shoes is, all right, whatever, I guess my flash is on. I'll also do flash on this. I don't know if you can see, but it's actually reflective. It's kind of hard to tell, because it's still light outside and this room doesn't get as dark. But it's actually very reflective. Like, I could be walking down the street or something in these and a car could be coming and they'd see my shoes and they'd, instead of hitting me, they'd swerve and they'd uh, crash into a ditch. I got these, I think, I, I wanna say 2020, I got these or 2019, but these are a great shoe. Uh, most of these shoes that you actually see around me, actually I bought with my own money. These, this is, these are not daddy's money or mommy's money, Steven's money. So keep that in mind. I'm not spoiled. Hopefully you can't see my feet. But yeah, let's go on another shoe. These shoes I actually bought. The only reason why I bought these shoes is because it was for my graduation and the grad dinner and dance or whatnot. Uh, but the brand is Noonan Bush since 1912. That's what it is. I think these cost me around 90 
80 to 100 dollars i'd say i can't remember the price for any of these shoes and it's called voice ctox there if you guys are interested that's what it is hopefully it focused because you're not getting another chance noonan bush thank you okay for these shoes these are the reeboks these were like on sale for like 90 dollars at Foot Locker, so of course I had to get them. And also, I just love the blue color. I have exact blue sweats that go with this, along with a, bl a blue crew neck, and also a blue shirt. So these were a good pair to pick up because blue and white pretty much go with nearly anything. So you throw on a fit, these will pop out a bit. Reebok with the United Kingdom flag, of course. Where are the English people at? I love England. I love English people. These, super rad. I like them. Some people say they're hospital shoes or like what nurses wear. I say nay nay. These shoes are actually really nice. They also do need to clean. I rarely clean my shoes actually. I like never clean my shoes. Oopsies. On to the next shoe we go. Okay. With these shoes, these are actually my basketball shoes. I haven't worn them in like three years. I'm being like legit, I haven't worn these. I probably wore these like four times in my whole life. Um, but yeah, I do have a little scuffs right there, as you can see. But actually, Lucas actually copied me with these shoes. I got these shoes and then two days later or three days later, he gets these shoes. I have Jeremiah that can vouch for me. Jeremiah knows, he copied me with these shoes. But yeah, these are really cool shoes. Uh, I I've only wore them for basketball purposes. You can see the lion on the back. Super sick. Like, this is a nice shoe that's only been worn like four times. It's only been sitting in a box. I got these, uh, I think 2019 or 2020. So three to four years ago, quite some time. Uh, these ones are my, honestly, probably my in my top five. Uh, they do have crease. As you can see, unfortunately, I do wear my shoes. Yes, I'm sorry, I do wear my shoes. Honestly, now that I think about it, these shoes would actually go good with this fit. Kinda? I say yeah. Uh, what are they called? They're called Nike Dunk Low Retro BTTYS. Bettys or Bitties? Uh, size eight and a half. White team gold slash white white. What the heck? I guess that's the colorway of these, but yeah. These were, I think, like 210. One of my most expensive shoes. 210 for a Nike Dunk Low. Also, they are sick. Uh, but oh, is that separate? I don't know if that's separation or not. But yeah, these shoes, they're good. But on a scale one to ten of comfiness, they're like a, they're like a four. They kind of hurt my feet. That's why I rock with Adidas a lot because Nike shoes are really sick. Like I'm always gonna keep buying Nike shoes. But for like long uh walking and running and stuff adidas is the way or an actual running shoe which is probably a, a nike running shoe not this these ones are actually my newest purchase uh like minute not minutes ago but like an hour or two ago i filmed the unboxing of these and those ones too so there's gonna be two separate videos on that but yeah these are super sick i have yet to wear these other than try them on uh, but yeah, just look at these. These ones are super sick. They're almost the exact same one as those ones I pointed at right there. Look at the tongue. Not the, I think, is this called the tongue? I don't even know. And there's the back of it. Super clean, super sick. Also the insole. You probably, this, is, this video is going to be uploaded. This video right now is probably going to be uploaded before the unboxing ones. So it's going to be a little mismatched. But yeah, I did a full recap on that one and that one. So go check it out after, I don't know, whenever it's uploaded. These, oh, here's one right here. These are my Nike slides. I got these for Christmas for my sister. They're around $50. So yes, not all this is actually is daddy's money. Um, but yeah, Christmas gift, $50. Don't worry, she got something in exact same return. These slides, I love them. Before I had these slides, I actually had um, champion slides. They were actually women's champion slides. Uh, there's a store that was closing down. I forgot what it's called. Maybe it, it was some type of store in the mall, KP Mall. 
that closed down and they were doing like a when stores closed down they do huge sales and this was these those shoes were only like twenty dollars so yeah these adidas freaking a uh believe it or not these ones actually walked and traveled further than my brothers ever have my my brother has ever traveled uh these actually came to me with Van to vancouver and alberta and whatnot um, these are the prime blue ones, but they look white. In some other lightings, these do actually look blue. Um, but yeah, these are very dirty. Look, as you can see, like a day before my, I, I was at my aunt's house. She uh, put these in the washer and hung, not hung them up, but put them in the sun to dry. And then a day later, I got them completely dirty. Uh, but yeah, these are terrible. These are like terribly dirty shoes. Uh, I should actually probably clean these now that I think about it. I should really clean these because these are like going out in public hideous looking like a hobo with these shoes. Yikes! Also, another NMD shoe that's very dirty are my other work shoes. Uh, these ones are just for work. I didn't intend these to be for work shoes, but they've got so dirty to the point where I'm just like, fuck it. I'm wearing these to work. Nothing nice. Because at my overnight job, you can literally wear anything. Like I wear shorts and a t-shirt to work. I don't need to wear a uniform or anything. So these beaters are for work only. I keep my nice shoes and nice clothing at home. Whenever I work overnight, I don't like to wear nice shit uh, because you're dealing with a lot of shit and that shit can get stained and dirty and whatnot. But these are my Nike, what even are these? Nike Air Max SC. Pure Platinum slash Blue Lightning. Ooh, that name to it. This one's super cool. It's almost exactly like that blue one I showed you, but the coloring's kind of... Also, literally, I have shorts that are this color. I don't know, can, can you see that? Shorts that are this color. And, and blue ones. And they're Nike. So these fit combos are amazing, immaculate. I'm telling you, blue shoes go with nearly anything. But yeah, these ones are sick. I've wore these only like probably twice. I only got these like a less than a month ago because I got these in Alberta. And it's currently August 5th. Uh, what else do I have to show y'all? What else? I showed that one, I showed that one, I showed that one. That one is that one. Um, I think that's going to be it for this video. Those are all my shoes so far as August 5th. 2023 uh i'm not too sure of the time but yeah that was my shoe collection so far i'm hoping it keeps growing and i'm hoping to add some banger pieces maybe like a travis scott or uh maybe other shoes like converse vans um what other shoes out there i don't really look good in jordans maybe unless if it's like a like an Air Jordan low like this, with the Jordan logo on the back, maybe like that. But like Jordan, like, eh, I don't, I don't think I look good in them. But yeah, uh, enough said. Let's end this video. Hope you enjoy. Peace.